Hey everybody, and welcome to Dustin Time. For those of you who are new, I'm Dustin. And for those of you who are returning, welcome back. I hope you're having a great day. As you may have figured from the title of this video and the thumbnail, I think I have predicted when The Sims 5 will release. If you stick with me to the end, I will explain how I think I have figured this out. So, without further ado, let's get to the facts. I will explain myself right now. Okay, so let's get to the facts. The Sims 1, or The Sims, it was released on February 4th, 2000. The game was released after the creator, Will Wright, lost his home in a fire. During the rebuilding process, he thought what an interesting and pain in the neck process to go through and thought it would be cool you know to have a game where you could build your own home yes the game did start out as a building game but quick right quickly learned that it would be much more fun as a life simulator so just remember this date february 4th 2000 not super important in the beginning but the dates do get important but that's when the sims came out so stick with me here okay okay everybody here we go let's get to the facts sims 2 came out September 14th, 2004, four years after The Sims came out. Personally, my favorite Sims game in the franchise. I didn't play Sims 1, wasn't around much for it. Sims 2, my heart. I love The Sims. It had so many details that really made the game feel alive and made it feel at home, even though there was no one around you and you couldn't really leave your lot without a loading screen. But remember, September 14th, 2004, Sims 2, four years later. So important okay guys here we go five years later June 2nd 2009 Sims 3 premieres a lot of people's favorite game in the series I like the Sims 3 don't get me wrong it was a great game this game packs expansion packs all that amazing content but the open world man nobody mentions it a lot of the places you went were rabbit holes I don't miss it that much but the thing to remember is it was five years later on June 2nd 2009 was the release date of the sims 3 very important to remember so you know pay attention guys it's so important okay guys here we go again six years later september 2nd 2014 here comes the sims 4 brighter smarter sims with more emotions this is where we are now we're six years into the sims 4 here in 2020 and it's a hell of a game there's no denying that does it have its problems yes but we all love it we all play it we love it so here we are six years into the sims 4 the sims 4 came out on september 2nd 2014 six years after the sims 3 so such important things to remember i love this game so much and this is where I currently spend a lot of my days okay guys here we go I'm gonna break it down for you before I give you my prediction and just for a little clarity the trailers you're seeing above me or to my side over here they are the top five Sims trailers for Sims 5 the top five Sims 5 trailers I found on YouTube they are not real they're not made by EA you can find them by searching Sims 5 trailers so, all right, so let's break this down again. Sims 1, February 4th, 2000, four years later. Sims 2, February 14th, 2004, five years later. Sims 3, June 2nd, 2009. Then you have six years later, Sims 4, September 2nd, 2014. Then you have us, current day, the day that I'm recording this, six years into The Sims 4 life. So, without further ado, here is my prediction. My prediction is, at eight years later, because we're already six years into it, we've already been promised at one point that we still had another year of Sims content. So, at eight years later, my prediction is, that these sims 5 or whatever name it's called because honestly i don't think it'll be called the sims 5 i think they'll rebrand it with something else but that's just my opinion i think the next franchise or the next installment of the sims franchise sims 5 
will come out on June 14th, 2022, eight years later. If you follow the math, that's a Tuesday. Most of the games were released on Tuesdays. Actually, all of the games except for the original were released on Tuesdays. Um, they were released on a 14th or a 2nd. Once again, this is all speculation. I did the research. I thought it was kind of interesting. I thought you guys might think it was kind of interesting. But that is my final prediction based on all the release dates and the time in between for all the Sims games. Based on the fact that we are six years into the Sims franchise, which technically, it, for the pattern, it should have been year seven, but we are already confirmed by the Sim Gurus to have at least another year's of, worth of material coming out. So, again, my final prediction for The Sims 5. June 14th, 2020. And I just hope that if they are making a Sims 5, well, they are making a Sims 5, they told us they are, but I just really hope that if they do make it, they make it well and that it has the things that we've been asking for that we're unable to get in this game. And I don't need open worlds, but I would love an open neighborhood. And I really hope that if it has an online aspect that it's not the whole game online because I personally won't really care for it too much. And honestly, it might question whether or not I'll play it. Um, but yes, everybody, that is my prediction for the sims 5 based on all the research that i found if you guys think something different make sure to let me know down below maybe you know something that i don't and if you do know something i don't like inside info i would love to have it please let me know so if make sure to hit like if you guys haven't subscribed if you haven't ding the bell so you can get notifications i post on here when i go live on twitch and thank you guys so much for watching and i really appreciate it and i love each and every one of you and i hope that you're having the absolute best day possible thank you so much guys bye